Here is another good news, Alacrity is coming to OpenBSC 7.1 and the version that is going to be shipped with is 0.10.0 which based on the release pages of Alacrity is not very far from it. The latest here is 10.1 and it's just like one version behind. I don't think we are going to miss anything significant. Uh, unfortunately, this won't be available on OpenBSC 7 or 6.9 or older things like that. So I have already upgraded to 7.1 a snapshot. If you are curious, how did I do it? Simply just type do as sysupgrade dash s, wait for the process to be finished, then restart your computer and bam, you're running the latest version. So I can show you here 7.1 and everything based on the tests I have done is working fine for example you can see that the transparency is working with minimum configuration actually uh, of course you need to have a PCOM installed and zoom in zoom out copy paste emoji support is working out of the box of course, for emoji again, you need to install this emoji font. I forgot the name, Noto, Noto emoji font. Otherwise, it won't render it properly. So uh, let's test the features quickly. So for example, if I want to zoom in, I press Control plus. So as you can see, it increases the, the, the size of the font. And for zoom out, so minus is decreasing and zero it resets the size and let's demonstrate the copy paste functionality so hello world and then if I just like select the text and I paste it of course I, I did it twice with the mouse middle click so it is working as well and of course I can do that with keyboard as well. So OpenBSC rocks. I press Control Shift C and then Control V, and then we have it on the clipboard without any issue. And this is the thing about Alacrity that I really appreciate it because I was war I was using URXVT since the dawn of time, and it's just like less than a week that I have switched to Alacrity. I have never ever used Alacrity before. Even on Linux, I, I never used it. I, I all the time have this like a bit, cons I'm a bit on the conservative side when it comes to the uh, switching to the new programs, especially these terminal emulators and stuff. But I was so frustrated with the URXVT, like especially on OpenBSD, Getting this emoji and Unicode support is major pain. And I didn't want to do everything again and again. And then here it, it works like my config files. Let's say I, I tune it, it works for OpenBSC, then it breaks somewhere else on Linux. I don't know, on Arch Linux, things like that. By the way, I also use Arch Linux. So I'm not just like 100% focused on OpenBSC, some things. On OpenBSC are not available, as I mentioned in my previous video, you can check it out. Like Docker, visualizations, uh, Kubernetes, and stuff like that are not really available on OpenBSD. So I have to, I have to use uh, Linux as well sometimes. And I, I, I run actually Arch, it, it's, pretty, it's pretty fun actually on that side as well. But uh, nonetheless, Yes, I was very frustrated with, with this URXVT stuff, this like copy pasting things for everything. We have to twist it, we have to like tweak it, make changes. And like the config files, my X resources was like hell, it was like three, four hundred lines of stuff now. It's pretty actually minimum, let me show you. It's nothing, it's just like nine lines of code and it's related actually to this like some of the stuff really needed i forgot why why it is needed but i needed this stuff so that's all just nine lines of code in the x resources and the alacrity configuration is almost nothing let me show you so 
dot config on my home folder and I go to the alacrity here and you can see it is just like 17 lines of course these are optional all of it uh, like for copy pasting thing you don't need any configurations and then since I'm a bit like partially on blind so I put this size to 12 and then the, of course the for window transparency I put the window opacity here and I have installed also PCOM and PCOM is running it is working alright on OpenBSD but not the best performance I have seen out of PCOM and this is the uh, PCOM configuration also is very minimum so it's just like four lines and it's about the focus and unfocus so let me show you what, what I mean by that so now I, I'm, I'm focused on the terminal right as you can see there is a partial transparency here but it's not fully transparent right so if I change the focus to let's say to the to the left side of the screen which is Firefox you can see that side become more transparent even so this is the all the configurations of the PCOM that I needed to to have which is pretty cool I'm, I'm surprised how well it is working actually Alacrity is working on OpenBSD and even now I'm running on the snapshot OpenBSD 7.1 is solid it is working fantastically without any problems and many shortcomings to my understanding have been addressed for example i get the better performance out of uh, firefox and there is more emoji support on firefox by the way if you don't know on firefox you don't have emoji support on openbsd which is a good and bad thing sometimes you need it sometimes most of the time you don't need it so you won't be cluttered by stuff if you want emoji support you you, you need to use something like chrome which i which i absolutely i I despise it but nonetheless yeah I'm, I'm very excited about 7.1 release and I think it is going to be one of the greatest release ever so that's all for this video stay tuned for more OpenBSD content have a great time cheers